Hey y'all, it's Martha. I'm coming to you uh, for a few minutes to share a haul with you. And it is a um, collective haul uh, from four different places. And the biggest order is from Timu. So I'll save that one for last. But um, I found some really cute um, stamps, clear stamps at Dollar Tree that I've never seen before. And we've got this with the flowers and um, with the words, just a note, happy birthday. Um, I like you, thank you. And you get the picture. <laughs> so there are several different word stamps. And then this one is really cute, I thought. We have um, a guitar, a cowboy and a horse, some little shoes and the word farm, and I guess that is a farmhouse, some kind of house. <laughs> anyway, I, you probably can't see them for the glare, so. And then another one, just some flowers. Now these are the ones that uh, I, I don't have. So I, there's probably some more out there that I don't have yet, but these were new to my store. And here's some flowers and feathers and this big, I guess you would call that a vase. So these were all really pretty, I thought. And then I bought a couple of pack of stickers. Look at these wild um, bright and foily <laughs> colors, rainbow colors. It's really bright and pretty. And then this one, it's got feathers and, um, it says it's, um, it says boho here. So I guess there's some boho flowers and feathers and paisleys and a little piece of trim. I guess that's what that is. I thought those are really pretty too, I thought. Didn't have any of that in my collection. And then, let me show you both of these at the same time. Um, I only had one Distress Oxide, and it was a vintage photo. And I decided I wanted to start building my collection, so I went on Amazon and I got a really good deal, I thought. Got these four for, I believe it was $22. So I guess that's a pretty good deal. And so, um, and then I went to Michael's. Um, I usually do my stuff online there, but, um, I got these two, and they were, um, I don't remember, I think, oh, I had a $5 off, or $10 off coupon, and 30, plus 30% 30 off, so I got all three of these, this one, they didn't have it so they had to send mail it to me but the shipping was free surprisingly or I wouldn't have bought it <laughs> but anyway I've been wanting this um tattered rose since I saw I think her name is pink strawberries doing a project with this color so finally I got it and I thought these colors might look good with it especially these two and then these two. But so I built up, building up my stash. Now I have eight Distress Oxides and hopefully I can buy some more next month. So here we go, let's look at, oops. Let's see what we got from, I bought a bunch, a lot of this is just um, stickers, but there are a few things. What I also am doing is trying to build up a Halloween stash, because I've never done much Halloween crafting. 
Uh, I've done a little few pieces of art, but um, I want to work on some Halloween stuff this year. Mostly I worked on this fall. So with that in mind, I got this cute, um, let me see if I can open it and kind of show it to, oh, let me get these smaller scissors. Oh, those aren't the small ones. Oh, well, let's just use them. They're here. Okay. So it's called Happy Halloween, 12 different designs times two sheets. So these are all kind of fun, I think really like this pattern. Looks like an old-fashioned pair of socks. <laughs> and then this kitty. And it says Boo. I like that. A little Freddy cat. Some spider webs. Uh, ghosts and pumpkins and skulls and bats and a little bit of everything. And this is pretty, purple and black. Um, I'm not sure what you call that pattern, but I would call it checkered, I guess. Bats and skulls and moons and scary trees and green. And this pretty green with polka dots. Ghosts and skeleton on black with red stars. And then these words that just say all of the Halloween words. And this paper is not as thin as you think it's going to be. And then all these little ghosties. And then this pretty pattern. So I like this set. Really nice. And in that vein I got some little dies here and it has ghosts and bats and lanterns and a cat and pumpkins and I don't know what that is probably a gravestone or something I don't know but I'll see when I I don't remember and then I got these cute clear, this clear stamp. It's a pumpkin wearing a witch's hat. Let's see if I can find something to make it easier for you to see. Probably can't really see it. But I will take it out. If I can figure out how to get into it. Here we go. Isn't that cute? Hopefully you can see that a little better. And then I got uh, this set of clear stamps. It's Halloween also. says I want I want to eat your candy <laughs> and trick-or-treat and a bunch of other cute little sayings which are kind of small for me to read right now um, let me see if I can get my magnifying glass Oh, smell my feet. Give me something good to eat. <laughs> and broomstick. Brooms in the fright night. Uh, some candy corn, bats. Just all kinds of little um, Halloween things. Which will show up better when I go to stamp them. 
And then I did not have any black lace. So that will be handy for Halloween. It's really pretty. I think it's over a yard. I don't remember for sure. But there's quite a bit there and it's pretty too. Okay, let me see. And... We have, I bought, they had these little flower dies for 39 cents. So I bought two. I'm going to keep one and gift one. Maybe. I might keep them both. <laughs> because they're, it's not, I have a little um, sidekick machine and it would be nice to cut two at once. And then this little fairy. And there were also 39 cents each. Can't pass that up. And then I got this cute, this is not Halloween related, I don't believe. Let me pull, it's just a cute, um... Oh, I think it's a Christmas one, actually. It's, it's a little girl with presents. I think. And a snowman. A little snow person beside her. So, I guess I'm trying to start building up a little bit of Christmas stuff, too. Now, uh, the rest of these are stamps, I guess, but I'll try to go through them quickly without, you know, doing every one of them. For cute little backing cards. Alright, let's dump them out here and see what they are. So these are just kind of like, um, that's a Christmas tree. So I guess these are like vintage. Some of them are Christmas and some aren't. Just some cute little vintage stuff looking women a victorian or yeah so i don't think they're meant to be christmasy just a few of them in here are just vintage victorian looking people and let's see a few more i'll show you a few more here so those are really cute, I thought. Be nice in some projects. Okay. Now. And these ones are Halloween, I believe. Yes, they are. bunch of pumpkins and bats and witches and haunted houses there's a skull that one's cute nice little mix here if you there's a vampire witch in her cauldron little pumpkins So there's just a mix, some cute, some a little spooky looking, but not real spooky. Oh, well, that's a weird one. <laughs> Ooh, look at that one. Yeah, I don't think I like that one very much. <sighs> I'm not gonna go that crazy. I just mainly want cute see Halloween stuff so 
We have a mix here. And there we go. There's that one. And this one might be Halloween too. Seems like I bought a couple of Halloween packages. Oh, it's not, it's flowers like vintage flowers. And this is kind of in the same vein as the first one I showed you, but it has more than just people. Like there's angels. Little girl. I don't know what this is. Oh, a little cup and saucer. So just kind of vintagey flowers, cups, people, angels, etc., etc. Okay. Now this one. It's um, like little fairies and little girl fairies and stuff. They're really cute. I've never been one into fairies that much. Although when I was a kid, I always went as a fairy princess for Halloween. Go figure. <laughs> but um, yeah, I thought they'd be cute. Fun to play with. There's one with just flowers, some of, they're just all colors, really pretty. Oh, that one's cute. So those would be fun to play with. Uh, maybe this one's Halloween. No, I must have only bought one Halloween. That's kind of disappointing because those are a little bit darker than I wanted. So I may have to order another. Oh, these are my freebies. They're just a bunch of stickers with a bunch of sayings and stuff on them. Um, I thought they were cute. Let's see. I'm sorry if you heard otherwise, but the truth is you are not at all difficult to love. Oh, that's cute. You are capable. You can do this. So a lot of encouraging quotes with cutie little animals. Let's see what this one says. We're going to make it through okay. That adorable little fox. Yeah, so just a bunch of pretty characters and encouraging quotes and statements. Life is scary and stupid hard, but I am grateful to experience it with you. Aww. So, let's see. But mostly, kind of a mess, but mostly fabulous. <laughs> That's me, for sure. Well, the kind of a mess part, anyway. <laughs> Aw, look at this one. It's going to be okay. How sweet. Um, this one says... It's a good world because you're in it. Oh, look at the cute little frog. Oh, and look at this one. It's okay to be whatever weirdo you are today. <laughs> That's cute. So yeah, I don't wanna go sit here and go through each one, but I like them all. I was hoping that there wasn't so many dark, excuse me,
scary looking ones in my Halloween, so I might order more, but there are several in here that I will use and love. See, like this is really cute. So, but we shall see. I've got plenty, I've got stamps and I've got dies, so I'll still be able to make some cute stuff for Halloween. All right, that's my haul from the Dollar Tree, Michaels, and Timu. So I hope you enjoyed, and I hope I didn't bore you too much. All right, I will be seeing y'all again soon. Bye now.